hunt for Stephen Wiggins drags into the 21st hour right now. The suspected gunman in the murder of a Dixon County deputy could be anywhere this morning and police want you to memorize his face. Those were the words from the sheriff. There is a blue alert in effect and a $12,500 reward on the table. We know you're seeing updates on all the TDOT interstate signs as well and getting alerts to your phone. And of course, we just want you to be prepared this morning. And while law enforcement is exhausted and heartbroken, they're not giving up until Wiggins is behind bars. We're tracking this story from top to bottom for you today. We have team coverage of the manhunt. We want you to stay safe and we want to honor that fallen deputy. News Channel 5's Dan Kennedy is live right now in Dixon County, really in the thick of that search. Dan, you've been there all night. What's the number one thing viewers need to keep in mind this morning? Yeah, I, we can't show that face enough. That mug shot, uh, the sheriff himself says he wants you to burn it into your brain. And then once he's in custody, forget about it forever. And remember simply the deputy whose life was lost yesterday in this senseless act of violence, a true terror in this small town of Dixon County. That search continuing, as you can tell, it's daybreak now, uh, but uh, it never really ended, even in the thick of darkness overnight. Uh, there were still searches by air and by ground. Stephen Wiggins is the man wanted for murdering a deputy yesterday here in town. His criminal history is lengthy. You're looking at one of his old mug shots. It's what we believe to be his most recent mug shot. In fact, he was just arrested a couple days ago for domestic assault and investigators say at that time he was high on meth. Now, because he has that lengthy criminal history, he has different appearances in all of his mug shots. But one thing that hasn't changed over the years is his tattoos. And you see those here picture this uh, provided to us by the TBI. We have that online as well. If you'd like to share it, we're talking about authorities from multiple agencies, state, local and federal aiding in the search going on almost 24 hours, but no confirmed sightings yet of Stephen Wiggins. Also new from overnight, his girlfriend has now been charged with first degree murder for her alleged involvement in the shooting death of Sergeant Daniel Baker. Baker was found murdered yesterday inside his patrol car. He was responding to a suspicious vehicle call when dispatch lost communication with him. It's not clear what happened in the moments leading up to this shooting, only that this boyfriend and girlfriend duo is believed to be responsible for this heinous crime that has shaken this community. We are. It's a family, it's a brotherhood. We have to stay together. Um, like I said, I was raised in it. So I've had to deal with this more times than I care to admit. And it hurts. I take it personally. So I'd like to see him brought to justice one way or another. If you encounter Wiggins at any point, simply call 911. Authorities reiterate the fact that he is to be considered armed and dangerous and could at this point be anywhere. Just call 911 and you could earn that $12,500 reward for information leading to that arrest. Reporting live in Dixon County, Dan Kennedy, News Channel 5.